Hello guys, it's Randall with BitRaged. So you may be wondering why I'm at the Robinhood webpage. Or maybe you didn't even know it was the Robinhood webpage. Basically this is a mobile app that was created by a startup to offer stock market trading for free to regular people. It revolutionized that niche. In fact, it created that niche, in my opinion. So, why am I talking about stocks? Isn't this a crypto channel? It absolutely is a crypto channel. But Robinhood is actually getting into something very close to home for us. So I'm going to share that with you in just a moment. But before we do that, I want to take you to an article. And I want to tell you about something that we're very excited about. So first of all, I just I really want to thank those of you who have subscribed, who have supported our channel, who have left comments telling us how much you've appreciated our videos that really does mean a lot to us and to show our appreciation we wanted to do a giveaway so once we hit a thousand subscribers we are going to be doing a giveaway and we haven't decided exactly yet what that giveaway is going to be it's going to either be bitcoin or a, another cryptocurrency but we wanted to thank you for your support and we want to do it in a tangible way so to be a part of that giveaway to be eligible all you have to do is subscribe make sure that you're you have signed up to be notified as soon as a video is dropped and just comment on a video that's all you have to do all right so with that out of the way i was reading this article earlier and it made some good points first of all one of the points was that there was a prediction that was made back before bitcoin hit $2,000, in fact, back when it was much lower than $2,000, that it would hit $2,000. And when that prediction was made, they were ridiculed because people could get not get it through their heads how Bitcoin could ever be worth that much. So why do I make that point? There are people who are saying Bitcoin's a bubble. There are people who are saying that Bitcoin is worthless. There's nothing behind it and it's going to crash. In fact, you'll see prominent people. You'll see bankers. You'll see people who work in governments. You'll see influential people making statements similar to that, that Bitcoin's going to crash. I want to ask you a question, though. When's the last time you heard anyone say that Monopoly money is a bubble or monopoly money is worthless. Probably never because nobody feels threatened by monopoly money. So why are people saying that cryptocurrency is worthless, that it's not backed by anything, yet there's such an offense against it. There's a push against it by banks and regulatory authorities. It's either worthless or it's not. And if it's worthless, you don't need to push against it because it's going to come to its own demise. So whether you agree with me on that or not, it doesn't really matter. You don't have to. But I think it's a logical uh, theory. It's a logical stance that cryptocurrency has value for several reasons. Intrinsic value based in, you could say, the blockchain or based in what it is offering. But it also has value in supply and demand because Bitcoin, for instance, is there's such a limited supply compared to the demand for it that it pushes the value up and that's why it hit twenty thousand dollars and that's why it could hit fifty thousand or even a hundred thousand dollars because demand will always push the value of any product up there is a book it is a book for kids it's an economics book for kids but i highly recommend it whether you're a kid or an adult it's the most practical, simple economics book I have ever read, but it's probably the best. It's not highfalutin, it's not nonsensical, it's just practical to the point. And it's called Whatever Happened to Penny Candy. You can buy it on Amazon. It's an absolute great book. If you do not understand economics, if you struggle with it in school, buy this book and read it. It'll just, you'll love the book. Absolutely simple, practical, down to earth. So if you can understand the principle of what in the book he calls penny candy. It's the idea that supply and demand, it's the idea that when the demand 
becomes greater than the supply. It will always push that price up. So my point is this. You can say Bitcoin's worth any amount you want. You could say it's worth $10,000 or it's worth $100 or it's worth $20,000. But in reality, Bitcoin's worth what the demand for it is relative to the supply. All right. So if suddenly, this isn't going to happen, but just to give you an example, if suddenly they were to find that there is 5 trillion Bitcoin that nobody knew about, and it just all of a sudden 5 trillion Bitcoin got pushed in the market, Bitcoin would plummet because suddenly there would be a huge supply that would offset the demand. So I see a lot of people on Quora, I see a lot of people on Reddit, making nonsensical statements about the worth of Bitcoin and how it has no value. And these people do not understand economics. They just really do not understand economics. But that's, I'm not going to rant about that, but I, I felt like that was something interesting. All right, so two more things here. All right, so we're back to Robinhood. Now, why are we at Robinhood? Well, Robinhood just announced that they're releasing a uh, cryptocurrency trading for their platform. And this is amazing on several levels. First of all, it's a mobile, uh, it's mobile cryptocurrency trading, which is something that it has been needed. Secondly, it is going to be commission free. They're not going to be charging commissions for trades, which is revolutionary. It's absolutely revolutionary. You tell me where there's another exchange that's offering free trading where you don't, there's no commissions for trading. Another thing is they're offering instant deposits from your bank account up to $1,000. Nobody else does that. And what I really like about the fact that Robinhood is entering this niche is several things. First of all, Robinhood has 3 million users. And as of November 2017, they were adding 300,000 users a month. Robinhood was a startup that revolutionized the stock market trading for your everyday person where anybody could download the app drop a hundred dollars in and buy some stocks that simple that easy they want to do the same thing for cryptocurrency and i think it's going to be big i think they're going to do really well because they already have three million users and suddenly and i was just talking about supply and demand this is why i was talking about supply and demand right now we have a certain demand for Bitcoin, a certain demand for these other cryptocurrencies. Suddenly you're going to have possibly 3 million users who maybe have never invested in cryptocurrency yet, who suddenly will have easy access, easy ability to buy at first two, it's going to be Bitcoin and Ethereum, then 16, and then they're going to add more cryptocurrencies. Suddenly 3 million people out of nowhere are going to have the ability to easily buy cryptocurrency and trade it. That's going to revolutionize this niche. I'm telling you, this is something you're going to watch going into February. This is going to happen in February. They're going to start with Bitcoin and Ethereum, and then the rest of these 16 coins are going to be added. I want you to pay attention to the coins that they list because when they go live for trading on the Robinhood app, you're going to see these prices skyrocket. There's no way they can't. When you add 3 million people who have access, and it's going to be limited to 16 coins. So 3 million people have a choice between these 16 coins to buy. It's going to push the prices of all these coins up. That's the law of supply and demand. It's going to happen. Now, this one shouldn't be on the list. It's it's a joke. The founder stated clearly it's a joke. I'm not sure why it's on there, but irregardless. We've had a number of comments from people who have said, listen guys, we appreciate that you're exposing scam ICOs. We appreciate that you're uh, showing us what coins are not good to invest in, but we really want to know what is good to invest in. Well, that's one of the reasons I'm doing this video. If you want to know some pretty surefire investments, and there's nothing guaranteed, and I'm not giving you financial advice. I'm not telling you that this is going to make you a profit. But I am telling you this is advice that I take myself. When I make a video and I tell you something, it's either something I'm currently doing or something that I would be doing. Seriously, something that I would definitely do myself. 
And when I sit here and I'm telling you, listen, these coins are going to go up. I'm telling you right now, these are coins I'm investing in because of the addition of 3 million users are going to go up. I'm going to highlight a couple here. First of all, Stellar. So Stellar has been talking to Stripe. And those of you who don't know what Stripe is, Stripe is a payment processor. I'm not going to go deep into it, but if you have never been in the retail space or never owned a business where you needed to have payment processing, let me just tell you that when it comes to payment processing, Stripe dominates. There's no two ways about it. Stripe dominates. And the fact that Stripe is talking about working with Stellar, supporting Stellar, is huge. In fact, just the announcement made uh, Stellar prices jump by 20%. So just think what happens if this actually comes to fruition, where the price is going to go. Now, couple that with the fact that Stellar is one of the, the cryptocurrencies that's going to be traded on the Robinhood app soon, here in February. The price is going to go up. So if you're looking for a cryptocurrency to invest in and you want something that's not a scam, you want something that is most likely has a very good possibility of going up, Stellar is a very good choice right now. Very good choice. And any of these coins, XRP, Ethereum, Bitcoin. If you put money into these right now, the chances of them going up considerably as soon as Robinhood is released or shortly after is extremely high. So you guys ask what to get into. Look at look at these look at these coins. Look them up. Check them out. I love Stellar. I really like it a lot. Um, I really think XRP is going to go up quite a bit as well because Stellar XRP are two that have been in the news a little bit here. All right, so sounds pretty interesting, right? Maybe this is something that you'd be interested in getting into. Well, you can download the app. I'm going to have a link in the description for you to download the app. Just click the link. If you do use the link, you are going to get a free stock from Robinhood. That's a great way to start out all you have to do is sign up using the link and you'll get a free stock i would encourage you to sign up right now even if you don't have any intention of putting any money in or you're not sure if you'll trade just because right now there's a waiting list and it's going to go based on that waiting list so if you wait till it's actually released you might get pushed farther behind the other thing is and this is a prediction I'm not saying it's going to happen, but I do think that there's a highly li high likelihood of it. Once Robinhood is released for cryptocurrency trading, chances are very good that within several months, they could be adding 100 to, th to 200, maybe 300,000 users a day. There's a huge possibility of that. You don't want to get caught in a position where you could have had access to trading for free, free trading, but you didn't sign up. So. I would recommend that you sign up. Um, you don't have to use my link. If you don't want to do that, just download it on your phone. But either way, I would recommend that you definitely sign up for it. So there's a link and on the app it will say get early access. So check that out. I would really recommend that you look into these coins and figure out the ones that you'd like to invest in um, and find a good point to buy in here soon because I really think that that'd be a good way for you to build up, start building a portfolio if that's something you're looking to do. All right, guys, so I guess that's about it. I thought we'd look at coin market cap as we close here because that seems to be the big thing for YouTubers to do is to go here. And I know I, 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 know I pick on YouTubers a lot, but hey, somebody's got to do it, right? So there's a lot of red, guys. Definitely a lot of red. But hey, if you know anything about me, you know that that's buying opportunities. And I put in several positions here. So thanks so much for watching, guys. I really do appreciate it. Thanks for subscribing. Please make sure you hit that bell to make sure you're notified as soon as we drop new videos. And please hit the like button. And don't forget to comment below and tell me what you think of the video. Tell me what you want to see us do next. We are taking all your, cons all your suggestions. And we are considering all of them. So... If we don't get to something immediately, it is on our list, but uh, we do run full-time businesses as well as do this channel. So we're trying to get content out as best we can and keep it high quality as best we can. So thanks so much, guys, and take care.